But here I'm gonna give you some things to look for if you suspect you're having slugs or snails in your garden. You see that shiny gloss there? Those are slug tracks. We'll see some slug damage right here. You see on the tip of the plant, it's like a little shiny gloss. It's another sign that you have slugs in your garden. And I'm gonna show you how I deal with that. This is one of my slug traps. We're gonna strain this out. We're gonna take one teaspoon of our yeast, one teaspoon of our unsulfur blackstrap molasses. This is to activate the yeast. We wanna use some warm water. Hot water is gonna kill our culture and we want this yeast to come to life once we add that water into that it. That warm water along with the sugar in the molasses is activating the yeast and that's what our slugs are gonna be attracted to. It will attract snails and slugs for up to 200 yards. Now what you wanna do is put this in the area of your garden bed, but not near any of the plants that you don't want the slugs to be attracted to. This is a simple way to control slugs in your vegetable garden.